So how's the summer going? Really busy, just kind of been pretty hectic, just kind of traveling all over the place, just different cities like every week. So just really busy, but a lot of fun, a lot of really neat experiences that not a lot of other kids get to do. So it's, it's been a blast. What's it like physically and mentally? To, is it, is training. it training? Yeah, usually like whenever I come home from something, I'll usually just like kind of just come home, get right in my bed and sleep it off. But you are so just kind of just go home and crash every day but I kind of figured it out because it was a pretty similar summer last year so kind of figured out the routine and just kind of kept the same system so it's been working so I'm gonna keep it the same. What, uh, what, what kind of have you learned about yourself from from the USA to the top 100 what, what are you kind of gathering about yourself this summer? Um, I'm just trying just being able to fill a role just, just being able to like kind of play a role and just try to play it to the best of my ability, like because when I go to those places, I'm not gonna be able to shoot all the shots. I'm not gonna get like all that. That's for the other guys. But I'm gonna, I have to rebound, I have to defend, block shots, make the extra pass, make the right plays, and just score, shoot when I'm open, score when I'm open. Just get get a limited opportunity to make plays and just try to make the most out of every opportunity you get. What areas of your game are you, are you really focused I know you want to get better at everything, but what areas are you really focused on? I'm really getting a lot of shots up and just yeah. really trying to get my shots straightened out. I'm trying to get, just, just try to fix a few quick little tweaks on my release. Just try to get used to that. So um, just a lot of stuff with my shot and then obviously just kind of gaining weight, getting strength and just being able to talk through contact and just work out. Also been working on expanding my post game just like, cause that'll be a nice weapon for me like this in the high school season especially. Mm -hmm. So I've been trying to utilize that. What's the AAU experience been like? I mean, growing up with the Barnstormers and now moving mm -hmm. and, and playing for Minnesota. It's been, it's been really crazy. Our team is our team is ridiculously talented. Yeah. Yeah. so many good players. So it's been a really, it's been a lot of fun to be around. Probably the most talented group I've been around for an extended period of time. We have all five of our stars are high majors, six men, and so high majors. So uh, it's it's been a really crazy experience. My opinion, probably the best team in the country. So just kind of just kind of stick together and try to make a big run at it in July. Um. What's it been like trying to help your dad recruit? <laughs> <laughs> it's been pretty cool. I like, dude, I'm a pretty like outgoing kid. I, I'm pretty friendly. I like, I like having like a lot of people to talk to. I like having friends. I like talking. So, um, it's been it's been pretty neat being able to meet like all these new people and meet like other people like through them and just being able to connect with all these people from all over the country. So, it, it's been it's been a really neat experience. Probably something I'll never experience again. So, it's, it's been taking advantage of it. How do you handle it? Because you know, I mean, you're you're one of these guys. You know that there's a lot of pressure, mm -hmm. and they're trying to figure out what's the best best fit for them. How do you kind of advocate for Iowa, but also kind of lay back enough to let them make their own decision? I just tell them like everything they need to know about Iowa. How it's just like a nice little family atmosphere, and how like it's just like a lot of fun to be around. My dad, like my dad, really likes to let his guys go. He likes to let them play. So it's it's like just kind of really like neat atmosphere. And like most of those guys, they come in, they're gonna play right away. They're gonna get significant minutes. So like. Just kind of using that and just being, just being like, just really though the family atmosphere of like the whole situation. Like everybody, everybody likes each other. There's not really any like differences on the team, so everybody, everybody's like one big unit. So just really that and just like push that, and hopefully they like. How about with DJ? He's obviously the, yeah. the apple of everyone's eye. The yeah. Iowa fans want him. Your dad wants him. You want him. Everybody wants him. But how have you been able? You, you've been well. He, he said you guys have pretty much been together for a whole month. What's yeah. that been like? It's been it's been really cool. Our relationship it was already pretty good beforehand, but it's really kind of skyrocketed. And we've gotten really close over the past past two or three weeks. So we're just we talk pretty much every day. Like we Snapchat all the time. We met. We come grown close with a lot of other people. So we just talk with them. And just like he was my roommate at uh, top 100. My roommate didn't show up, so he moved into my room. So, yeah. So we spent uh, we just spend a lot of quality time together. And so that's been that's been pretty good. I always tell him like we can. This doesn't have to be the last time we're going to be roommates and just like a lot of stuff like that. So yeah, we've really it was a really natural bond. That's why I said to cake yesterday. It's just a really natural bond. It wasn't forced or anything like mm -hmm. that. Like we've always just kind of gotten along. I've known him for a long time. So it's just it's just been. Really cool. How motivated for you? This is crazy enough. Going to be your senior season to to you know. Yeah. This is it. This is yeah. the this is your legacy now for mm -hmm. at West High. Mm -hmm. Last goal around. I got I got a lot of uh, personal goals, but mainly just the biggest team goal. Just try to get back down state and win that again. So hopefully we can redeem ourselves from last year and finish on a high note. How's your brother doing? I know it was a had to have been a tough year for him. Was that tough for you to go and watch him go through that? Yeah, it was definitely tough. Like it's New Year's Eve and he's at our house like throwing up his like good times. So it was it was brutal, but I mean he's in at least he was home a lot. I got to see him <laughs> a lot. So uh it, it was it was really tough for Smear, but now he's back on his feet, he's been going, he's been practicing really well. 
um, in the summer with the basketball team. So I, mean, I think I think he's going to have a really strong year with the basketball team. So I'm excited to see him finally be able to contribute.